Welcome back to the Order of the Vine. Ah, it's a training room. It wasn't on the marked on the map. Well, it's gonna be a little awkward to get through, isn't it? Electric lighting, not being seen. Hmm. This isn't really gonna help with that. Well, it makes it some gives us some darkness in that corner. I don't know. Maybe that's good enough. Oh, he actually fired that time. the armory through that door and from there get through to the training room see if there's anything of interest at the far end of it. Oh hey. Someone behind me? Yeah. Stealing your wallet in fact. Don't see anything now. No I stopped. This was nothing. What's that? Who goes? It's a stand here. Oh, okay. All right. Well, I mean, maybe I should be trying to get into the bar. It says the stairs here as well, actually. Oh, right. Yeah. Mm, separate. This is room. It's not the armory. Let's worry about the bar because we know the bar has loot, right? What's this way? Okay, so that's going to be the main hall. Is that door? Can we try and grab these candles? Because <laughs> these guys might be drunk, but they do have their swords are still sharp, right? Okay, your arms are long. There we go. Still not anywhere near enough loot. But, uh... Oh, that's gonna need a key then. I have a treasure key, but I don't have any other keys. Right, and this is the stairs. Okay, there's a door here. Hmm. What is this? West wing up is off, down is on. East wing up is off, down is on. Alarm system. Okay, the east wing alarm is off, the west wing alarm is... Let's turn it off. Hmm. 
You know what? I'm gonna... Well, I don't know. It feels sneak, properly sneaky to do that. But yeah, okay. He saw me. Why don't you come over here and swing that thing at me? And drop yourself in the shadow like a good guard. It's just weird. What's this for? Nothing on top of it. Oh, he's turned it entirely around. I want lots of free, uh, free arrows. I think he saw me. There's a secret room behind there. Then there doesn't seem to be. Oh, except I didn't want to get in the armory, don't I? Yeah, so I should have knocked him out. Oh, this guy's got the key. Aha. Uh -huh. Interrupted. This is just shoved. Oh, this is key rack. Battlements key, okay. Swords, don't think we need those. Fire crystals, I mean, I'll take them with that. I don't know if I need them. More arrows. This shelves at eye height are a little uh, hard to tell if I'm missing anything. More swords, a sword hilt, broken swords. Oh, they're, they're broken, they're all broken. I've heard someone faintly say, Get back here, you coward. I don't know. Why? <laughs> hey, Burke. Okay, there's nothing else on this shelf. It may have just been the guy attacking the uh, training dummy. Oh, I have this key. I guess I'm going to be going upstairs then. This is the east wing, which is where the uh, guy should have special items I'm supposed to get, right? Some kind of... Well, I guess there's a rare item in his chamber. Steal it. They did say the east wing is where all the uh, wealthier rooms or something, the better rooms were, something of that sort. Messages for the head of the guard. What then? Long did he talk any sense into Kiplin? I've been trying to reach him for the last week, but he ignores my messages and he's nowhere to be found during the day. Maybe you could talk to the master about him. Something's not right. If you need to speak with me, my room's just around the corner at the end of the corridor. Dirk. Just 
strange they have different locks. That's very odd. Well, what's happened here? Chair's been knocked over. Keys in the master bedroom. I believed for a long, long time after Midia's death, my life could have no more meaning. But I am not uncontent here. The lord of this place is quite jolly and has made me feel welcome. I have not found out yet how the old head of the guard, Rurai, died, but I expect it to be no great matter. No doubt the old fool fell drunk on his sword or some such mishap. I dreamt last night of Midia in Cragscleft. It was the day of her execution and dozens of damned hammerites surrounding her, pounding and pounding at her with huge hammers. I tried to scream, Stop! She's my wife, not some pagan witch! One of them turned and began to laugh slowly. His mouth opened wider and wider until it seemed to swallow me up. I was standing in a dark black room with nothing but Midia's battered, bloody body. I expected to wake, but I found I couldn't. I just lay there cradling her head for what seemed like hours. I woke when one of the guards entered my room. It was almost 15 minutes late for the morning inspection. It was probably, probably the shortest inspection I've ever made. Today passed routinely. Rune attempted to explain to me how the gas hops in the kitchen worked, but I told him to stop once he started about control devices and water steam receptions, whatever they are. He seems a nice enough fellow, rather excitable about technical matters though. No one will tell me what happened to the old head of the guard. I intend to ask the master about it tomorrow. The master told me the old head of the guard died exploring some sort of ancient ruin beneath the order's residence. The master has promised to show it to me. I'm not sure that the Master and Giblin are entirely, well, men. Giblin's face contorts strangely from time to time, and I think the Master is the same, although he seems more controlled. I'm starting to wonder whether there's something sinister happening here. I've used the Order's library to research them a little. It was disturbing. These people, at least the Master and Giblin, I don't think the guest is too bothered, worship one of the old gods. It seems to tolerate man as one of its underlings, I think if we ever challenged it, it would have no hesitation in destroying us. I'm going to research a little more to try to find out what he would regard as a challenge to his power. Hmm, sounds like you got into st stickier business than you're prepared for. Oh, hello there, face. What are you keeping in this chest? Try to pick a lock with a healing potion. Good work, Garrett. Oh, valuable sword. Alright, we're at 1042. We're not that far off our loot goal now. We have all these upper rooms. I was thinking it was going to be a problem, but it doesn't seem like it. Hmm. <laughs> hey, Guinea. He does turn. Do you have sand arrows? I don't, don't know if it's the right time to use them. There must be the alarm light there. Oh. Someone behind me? Can't hear it anymore. Probably nothing. <laughs> The new head of the guard seems a good fellow. I don't know if he was as good as Rurai, poor man. You always knew where Rurai was coming from. That man thought more with his sword than his head. This new bloke though, Horton, he seems to think too much. He's too quiet for a head guard. He needs a good night out with the rest of us at Madame Le Bonnes, I think. Ha <laughs> ha. Most of the guests are going on a hunt tomorrow night. I know what I'm going to do while they're gone. Straight to the bar. I'm sick and tired of all this. Yes, sir. Toilets up, we mess. I'll clean up that vomit, sir. Tomorrow night I'm going to empty every bottle in the building. See how they like that. I hope I lose my dinner in one of their potsy rooms too. Gotta stop writing. This bottle's empty and I'm sleepy. There is a patrolling guard. Ha <laughs> ha 
Let's uh, see. <clears throat> oh wow, it's more than one. So the one guy just standing there, and this other guy's patrolling. <clears throat> oh, this guy's standing, turning, sitting, waiting. Yeah, my thoughts exactly, man. Noising about then. That's the last time I jump for rats. Mm. <sighs> he sometimes turns the face down the corridor, but. Oh, he sometimes turns to face this way too. All right, so I could have waited in that other shadow instead of this one. <coughs> hmm. It doesn't necessarily give much of a window for getting down that corridor. I don't see why I should have to be the one down here in the cold and the dark and the damp. You're upstairs, man. It's not that cold, dark and damp. Well, there's almost nothing left in the ordered coppers. I'm worried when my wages are going to come from next week. Where could all the money have gone? We've been raking it in from these fools. You know, building the new house for the order is expensive, but it's been planned for years. I bet we're having to pay off the hammers. I can't believe they let this place stay open. And me neither. Okay, you are potentially dangerous there. Quarters. <laughs> oh, you better not wake up, man. Okay. Seems seems safe. Oh, water arrows, okay. I won't complain about a good water arrow. Hmm. 
Yeah, I can probably just go anyway, just bite him. Looking this way, right? Yeah, it's fine. Something happened here. I wonder what happened here. Good question, Garrett. <laughs> Don't have a golden candlestick, I'll take that out. Master. I didn't want to do this, but I thought it was your right to know. You're a good man, and you've treated us all very well since you became head of the Order. But I think Giblin might be taking advantage of your generosity. He's been very careless with his duty recently, and... Ha! So Giblin finally decided to pay me a visit, did he? Well, I'll just finish what I'm writing. <laughs> oh, so Giblin decided to pay you a visit? Pick up Giblin's key. Durkin. Hmm. Poor old Durkin. Dead as a gherkin. That work. Gherkins aren't really dead, are they? I mean... Plants are kind of alive when you pick them, like fruits, because they ripen and stuff. I don't know. So now I've got to get down this hallway. It's all guards' quarters. Okay. Are you sure he said the East Wing <clears throat> was, where all the, was where all the guards are, not where all the good rooms are? Maybe I mis misremembered. Gap in the patrols. Aha. Uh -huh. Master bedroom is concealing something. Sand error. This is secret scroll number four or five. I haven't decided where the scroll is going to be yet. Did I think of a good spot? Who is this prankster leaving secret scrolls all over for me? Did they even tell the mission also that they were going to do it or they just like uh... Oh so here we have to wait for these two guys to both go that way again. Hopefully they're close enough together. Kind of sounds like they might be. So I guess I'm... Is this still kind of the master bedroom or is this part of the guest rooms? Doesn't seem to be anything in this room. Guess it's nice and dark here. Guard right there, okay.
I've got plenty of moss, so I can certainly put some on this. Uh, I've still got plenty of water. That's probably he's probably stupid. That's probably just a dead end. I do want to get past him, right? What's going on over there? I don't like going out, so I can. about guest rooms. Hello candlestick. Hello balcony? Oh okay. <laughs> we do get out of the house. We can't get out of the house onto the into the yard. Well, if I go down there, I won't be getting back up, right? Hmm. There is a ledge across to that balcony, but it's very narrow. That would be not really enough to stand on properly. Let's not go that way. Disturb her sleep. <sighs> Dear brother, it's coming to the end of the week, and I'm still certain that no one here apart from myself has any real idea of what paganism is. Most of these have a dislike for the Hammerites and think that's as far as paganism goes. They're actually going on a hunt for sport tonight. I can't believe the hypocrisy of these people. To top it all, I lost my ring yesterday. I know I had it when I was watching the play, so it can't be there. Anyway, I hope you've got the hammers to install that heating system by the time I get back. Which will probably be about the same time as this letter. Silly me. It's starting to get cold. Sarah. Well, we found her ring in the theatre already. Empty. Nothing hiding behind that painting. What have we got here? Dear sister, we've been here two days now and I look forward to returning home tomorrow. I found the entertainment here to be quite mediocre. Not that Duran cares. As long as there's a bottle of wine and other menfolk around to discuss his horses, he's happy as a taffer in a bank vault. The other women here seem content to lightly sip and quietly so. I find myself rather idle. However, sister, tonight will be different. I plan to tie up my hair, take out Duran's spare clothes, and dress as a man for the hunt. It'll be quite dark, and I can ride as well as any man in our town, as you know, so it'll be quite easy to deceive them, them being menfolk notwithstanding. I can't wait to beat these men at their own silly games. Jermaine. Okay, I mean, these people are all guests here, but... For what? What is the place? Ah, is this Jibbon? No. It's not the battlements, obviously. It's not going to be the armory. Okay, we've got a locked door here. I 
thought I came up here and went this way. I definitely did, and I thought I'm, I'm over here now. <clears throat> well, I mean, no, this is definitely the eastern side. Oh, I must have come. I must have got confused up here. Hmm. But I saw the map and it said highlighted that one at first. I'm, I'm confused. Anyway, we've got a locked door. Yeah, this is this is this hallway, right? I, no, I'm very confused. I feel like I've got turned about. Anyway, we've got a locked door with a key down here, I guess. <clears throat> key I do not have. Let's try not moving while he's facing this direction. friend is as well. Oh, it's the main hall. Okay, there's definitely the eastern side then. I definitely got confused. Maybe Gimlin's key opens this. No, is this the battlements? Aha. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay, well, this is, this is huge. This is far huger than I expected. Right, we came down that canal past the drawbridge. Okay, and there's battlements on the other side too. Can I see if... I don't want to shoot him, I just want to zoom in a little. He doesn't seem to have anything on his belt, does he? No. Not these two. So I don't see there's a reason for me to be up here. Well, I can get down to ground level easily enough, right? I'm sure this guard's standing right the other side of that door. In the main hall. So again, I don't see a reason to come up to the battlements particularly. But it does provide a nice way across the main hall without, without difficulty. Yeah, there's two guards right there. Oh, I wonder if they have pockets to pick. I wonder if I could see that from here. Don't think so. If they did, that would be a good way to get to it. Oh, dang. Another vanishing door. Oh, you saw me. Don't know if he's going to come in here. I thought he was, I thought he was facing the other way. I'll find you. Damn you. I think he will find me. Oh, he's given up. Good. 
<sighs> Act 3. A graveyard. There are signs of recent digging. digging. Into the reserve, followed by Tracus. Tracus is horrible. They've actually done it. They dug up her body. I see it, Larissa. How could they do this? The Hammers respect that created by man, their religion, their buildings. They do not respect a man himself. How can you say that after all they've done? What, Larissa, what have they done? Dragged us from simpler times to these days of crime, hatred, and choking obedience? I will not thank them for that, and nor should you. I cannot believe they did this, Mother. Larissa kneels and cries at the grave. Come, we must go. Curtain. <laughs> well, I don't think your play is going to be hugely successful because it'll take about <laughs> half a minute and then the audience will be wondering what they paid good money for. West Fifty, will you do me the honor? Will you join me for marriage? The Book of the Hammerite defines it as You're not married, are you? Because well, I'm not. And you're not, though pick a hand, left or right. You're so lucky you get to marry me. Yeah, I keep looking on those lines, kid. Twelve fifty nine brings us past the loot goal. All right, haven't found any signs of the rare item yet. In case there is a guard in that passage. Hello again, brother. Everything is fine. My repentance should be attached. I hope my little is feeling better. You should buy out some of those herbs. I've gotten friendly with two of the other servants. Lithia, a chambermaid, and one of my roommates. And Rune, one of the chefs. Lithia says Rune is obsessed with me. I think she's just jealous. He's nice, just a little too quiet and intense for my taste. Bye. I'll write again in a week. Where's Sifni? Is that Rune's room we were in then? Just a minute ago? Dear diary. I heard one of the guards has her piece, and that the hammer's looking for a her heretic in town. I bet that guard's keeping a low profile. Dear diary, I'm getting more worried about Rune and Wesidney. She doesn't know how intense Rune can get. I tried to tell her, but she got a little angry and said I was jealous of her. Today I saw Rune going into a jeweler's in the town. I hope he didn't do anything stupid. Dear diary, I saw something strange today. While the master was on one of his inspections, I spilled hot water on his arm while changing the bedpans. His face changed somehow. His eyes seemed to glow for a second, and then it went away. I pretended not to see, but I really want to get away from here. Dear Diary, I was talking to Durkin earlier, and he's still very suspicious of Giblin. I've been hearing strange moans from his room at night, so I've decided to help him a little. I stole Giblin's key so Durkin could make a copy of it, and put it back before Giblin noticed. We're going to look around in his room tomorrow, since he doesn't seem to be around during the day. I have to get a copy of that key myself. Did that just... Here, there. Where's Sydney? Oh no, I just walked over without seeing him. I know we have only known each other for a short time, but well, I have something important to ask you. Will you meet me in the garden tonight, while all the guests are on the hunt? Please be there about eleven. Thank you. Room. Okay. Don't wake up, man. What's that? It's me picking the lock on this chest. Mostly non fatal. Nothing to be worried about. Whereas opening a door straight in front of a guard may sometimes be rather less non fatal. So 
There's a cable in this room? There's not too Goblin, I'm sick and tired of this. Either do your tapping job or go to the master. Do you know what your problem is? You just think you're so much better than the rest of us with your own room and your big purse. What's up with you and the master anyway? You both spend far too much time together. Durkin, head of construction and maintenance. Yes, that's right. I have a job, which I actually do. Taffer. Giblin, I still need to get a response from you about the construction of the new seat. My room's in the east wing if you need to talk to me. Durkin. This is, this is messages for the head servant, I see. Giblin. I need an update on our finances. The construction on the Order's new seat has stalled because the workers haven't been paid. We've nothing built except the outer shell and a few rooms on the bottom floor. What's going to happen to the rest of it? I know there's enough in the coffers to go on with the construction. Why haven't you paid for the completion? Durkin, Head of Construction and Maintenance. Giblin, my aide. I have made my decision. We will proceed as planned. Continue with your arrangements. Hello. Why aren't you responding to your messages? All mine are still up here. Do your job, Giblin. It's not like you, you have a lot to do. Durkin. What's is this just stairs down then? Okay. Let's just check this room first. It's gotta be one in every mission. That's there is a law. It's uh, you contract everyone signs when they first open the drawing is that they will put at least one troll chest in every mission. I don't know why the master has asked us to keep diaries. Who's going to read them? Not as if my little thoughts will go down in history. Anyway, I won the bet with the guard. I finally got a room with a window. Some of the guest rooms don't have any. I hope he likes my old room. Ha <laughs> ha. Keeping diaries at the request of the master? That's strange indeed. is definitely not right here. Furniture's all changing size too. Ooh. Wonder if I can lock him out. I mean, he should have his own key to his own room, right? the guards well it does sound like this is my opportunity to get up here Master is not easy. Think me not why he satisfies these man fools. He thinks he dislikes the gift the honey maker puts in him. Foolsy him more than these man fools. Vile man fools. Drinks he these their wine, eats he them meats of his forest. Master's friends are they, dine master with these. Laughs him like them, takes he him these monies. 
Me hope sees die slowly like at least these who goes on the hunt. Trixie theirs. There pulls he his beasts they skins from their bones. Feasts them well on their fattened flesh. Hunt see man flesh. Hunt see back they brain into their skull. <laughs> so who is that? going on here. Ancient silver key. Vines. I mean, it is the order of the vines. It makes sense I've got vines. Hmm. Wish I knew who that was. Get the sound arrows, but uh, hit the wrong key. So, hang on, was that quick? Quick saves I load. No, okay, okay, okay. Let's lock this room again. in case it makes a difference to his behaviour, but he's not here this time. Don't know where he is. I do know where he is. I think he saw me. Or caught a glimpse. Doesn't work it either. Or maybe he's just smelling them. Mmm, that smells like shit. That's not a person. After all, crawling it down in those uh, bathrooms. Well, that's not a useful place for to stop. 
You were much better off down in that corridor. Hmm. I got rid of that, got that gold. I didn't remember secret number four was here, right? So there's a basement somewhere as well. Strange silver key is not going to work. Be for that door that I have. That I couldn't open. Locked guest room. <gasps> Must be the one we need, right? Just battlements. What's through that door? It's kind of a mid level. Dining hall. I have not been in the dining hall. Okay. Oh, the door's gone. Whoops. So I could lead that guy around places to have him fight guards. Do these guys have pockets? Have pockets fit? Is someone there? Oh, wow. They do not have pockets pick. I forgot that the guy across the room was looking straight at the door, but thankfully he's a little bit blind. Oh shit, he's just looking this way. Peaceful enough now. I think you mean thief's full. Is that a way up that I haven't been? Oh, shit. It does look like it might be. Yes, I've not been here at all. Okay. Where is this going? He doesn't help me here. It's not battlements, it's not the armory. It's definitely not the treasury because we've already been there. It's not going to be the ancient silver key yet. Okay, so we've got another locked door. Uh, is that the master bedroom then? Maybe that secret number four wasn't was in a guest room? I don't know. Yeah, it was a locked here. A locked door there as well. This would make more sense to the master bedroom. I think it was just all turned about before. Oh, he's patrolling. Where did he go?
going away. Oh, this guy's gonna make life less convenient for me. Oh, bollocks, the archer's coming there. Let's hope he doesn't notice me here. Swordsman is coming back. Box. Oh, he's facing away. Okay, so let's go sit in the shadows here. The dining hall. Is that really just a statue? I don't know. Ah. Oh. I think I know where the strange silver key goes. Go to what god of Arcady, this one world is grey and old. And what remains to us of thee? Then blow some trumpet loud and free, and give thine ocean pipe away. Ah, leave the hills of Arcady. This modern world hath need of thee. Well. What's going to happen when I do this? Oh, it's not going to work. Right size, but it's not the right key. Okay. So... Maybe there's another key we need first. Maybe we need his panpipes. Here is it. <clears throat> it okay if I don't move. And then people up above me get all the light and get all the favors, and I don't have another thing to eat in days. You know what? I think this might be when I end the episode. So thanks for watching. And um, when we come back, we'll see what's down that left corridor.